All right, so for lunch today, I am going to be making some baked tilapia um, panko, half panko crusted baked tilapia and peas and carrots and a side salad. For later, I wanted to have some tuna salad, so I've got a mixture of tunas going on there. A little bit of oil into said pan. And then I'm going to start here with a little bit of onions. Oh, no. I'll play that up real nice. Actually, I think I will do... A little bit of carrot. Okay, a lot of carrot. I just need a little for my salad. Salo. Let that saute for just a second. Oh, elbow. For me, personal preference, I like. A little freshly ground coarse black pepper, a little pinch of coarse salt. I'm gonna pinch now and pinch later. Here, I really feel like I should have put garlic in there. Ooh, is it too late? It's never too late. Never ever too late. Shh. Garlic for the win. Keep them moving. Moving and grooving. That shot. A little garlic. Don't press her there. Why? Because she'll get bitter. Nope. Don't want that. I leave that there so it can warm up. Why? Because I'm putting my stuff right back in there. That's why. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Peas and carrots. I don't know what why this has been on my radar lately, but I am having serious seeds and carrot cravings. Now's a good time for that little bit of extra flakes. Just a little. Like, we don't want to get crazy with it. Fresh garlic. That smells great. Yes, it does. In for the scrape of the extra garlic. Why? Because this press seems to need to be fondled just a little bit to really get in there. Just stirring that around. Oh. I guess I'll save that for snow. There's snow. There's a pea. I think those are done, done, done. Here comes the wind for me trying to get. I'm actually going to turn those off. And let him sit there. Oh, pee. <laughs> I just felt that I dropped another one. Smash peas. Reminds me of my time in Ireland. But for the second part, we're going to do a... What are we doing? A... Um, hmm. Tuna salad. What do I have? 
for the tuna salad. I guess I can actually start with my cold salad. Why? Because, I don't know. Why not? Let's start with a cold salad. Cold salad first. I like spinach. Yep. And why? Because it's dark and leafy and full of vitamin K and all that great stuff. So, dark, leafy green vegetables. I'm going to eat that. Oh my goodness. This got stuff everywhere. <clears throat> and then for the second, a yellow green coming in second with some romaine. Not very much nutrients there, so I just put it in there because I like it and it adds variety. And it's pretty. So, add that in there. Pop. Okay, what else do I want in here? Some sugar snap peas. Yep. Ooh, that's about to be good. Sugar snap peas. Mmm. I mean, just like seriously, put this stuff together however you want it to look. Artichoke. Little marinated artichoke. Put that on the side there. What else? Cilantro. Cilantro. A little bit of cilantro. For my salad. Why? Because I'm pairing this with... Oh, elbow. I'm pairing this with... Um, that right there. Some fish. Oh, I can't wait. Yes, just put that right in the middle. Actually, I just want it all over the whole salad, okay? Careful not to cut those gloves. All right. So, since I have the um, panko crusted, half crusted tilapia coming out of there, then I will keep this a little bit of Line. Okay, I just want to like forget that it's on there and come back to it. Seriously. Okay, little carrots. Put those all over just like sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle. What is this? Roasted red peppers. Put those all over everything also. What do I have here? Yellow onions for all my little ones out there. My daring little ones who want to try the onions. There they are. Just try it. Okay, might be a little bit different, right? But that's okay. Just try it. You'll learn to like it or appreciate something about it. You don't have to love it, but it's okay to enjoy a little bit of it. Some lime. Why? Because I'll probably have extra tilapia and I'll add it to my um, salad later. Oh, my daughter. She wanted me to have croutons. So she brought me a big bag of croutons. And since I love croutons, I'm going to dress this baby up with some croutons. Boobity bobbity bam. Yep. 
a little bit of a runch. Just a little bit. You usually don't want to put this on here. Ugh. No, I better put it on the side. I just know me and I don't want to put too much. So I'm not going to eat the rest of it. So I can just dip a little bit and go back. I'm going to top it with some total Greek seasoning bop. Hi, because it's fun. Yeah, let's put a little extra. Okay, what else? What's next, I should say? What's next is going to be tuna salad. Or later, tuna salad. Mixture of love and spices. All that good stuff. Ooh. Shake it up, shake it up. There it is. Mix it in there. Why? Because it's all really up to preference. I like some of it sweet, some of it savory. So I'll start with the savory. Mixed tunas. Why? Because one is usually a little bit too heavy. Don't forget to move that. Um, to move that around in the pan. Where is my spatula? And the counters first so you don't have to worry about using it. I just want to taste this, okay? Let me taste. Mm. <laughs> Peas and carrots. Back to the tuna. Mixed tuna for the win. Into the bowl. No, I don't want to do that first. I like to make sure this gets all incorporated. What? A little of that. Generously put that in there. Just fluff it in there. Move it out the way so you can see. Okay, gotcha. A little more. A little more. I actually want you to kind of out of the way. So you can really get those gloves in there. And get the seasoning mixed in. A little herbs. There was already <clears throat> some lemon on the tuna, but I add a little bit more after I add before or after. It doesn't really matter to me. might matter to you, but after I add all the seasoning and make sure that's all mixed in there nicely. Just touch every piece, okay? Why not? You made it. <laughs> touch it all. All right. Actually, let me add lime. Let me do it over your hand so you can catch all the seeds. Because let's be honest, nobody likes that taste. So if you see it, grab it. If not, use your hand as a little strainer. Just like that. Done like that. Mix, 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 mix. A little bit more mixing. 
greens. In this case, some cilantro. Gotta hurry because our fish already dinged. Ding. This is really up to preference. Like I said, some people like it sweet, some people like it savory. Here we go. Not a good usage for the left. Or for the right nursing that elbow needs love love crazy love so that's what I'm doing using the other hand might take me a little bit longer but that is a, a okay right Yes. Okay, let's see what this tastes like. And I'll add more stuff to it as the days go on because you want to watch your mercury levels and not eat too much um, tuna. Mm. Let's see. I'm going to say muy bien. Mm -hmm. Muy bien. Muy, 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 muy bien. Okay. Very good. Mm. Okay, that is not my lunch, so I need to put a lid on that while you guys are watching. So I can seriously be done. Oh, geez, I cannot. With all that extra going on. Put a lid on there. And put it away oh elbow didn't make it through okay you guys well i have my peas and carrots my salad and my tuna salad and i will see you guys in when i'm done with this all right peace